Welcome back to a new weekly vlog. How's everybody doing? Guys, I have missed you so so much. Today we are vlogging and I am so excited. Like I genuinely enjoy vlogging. Today I wanted to switch up my look. I'm usually like always 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 putting on lipstick. Today I wanted the look to look a bit more classier. I don't know how to explain it. So I applied some lip gloss and it looks kind of decent i i had actually filmed this whole makeup look and then i was like am i really confident enough to post this makeup look and i was like you know what no we need we still need to perfect a few things like for example i've not applied any setting powder and i also need to get like a good pigmented eyeshadow eyeshadow palette like there are just a few things here and there that i need to perfect until now and and then now i can be filming makeup looks i'll be so happy because i really do enjoy like makeup and um yeah for the edges i use the nice and lovely styling gel extra firm hold i got the small one because this one was only for 100 pop and i only needed it for like laying my edges and then i use a toothbrush now for the edges i feel like they look better when you use a spoolie but since i didn't have a spoolie i decided to improvise it so yeah the other day i went to the supermarket and i got myself some planters here they are they're green in color they had like a variety of colors but they have orange white black and then green but i felt like green would look so much better but then the plants i i have two plants and they're in this very ratchet looking containers so i'm excited to switch up into this because it will give it such a clean look and i'm happy about that now another thing i wanted to talk about are the dove products now i've seen these dove products being talked about so many times especially on tiktok and somebody who has like used the products firsthand i felt like it was only fair for me to come on here and give you a review because i've used these products for like a month now and to be honest i've not had any problem whatsoever like i've not had any reaction oh i feel like the light is a bit too much guys i want to apologize for the lighting i feel like today the lighting is not the best just bear with me because it's a bit dull outside it looks like it wants to rain so yeah um as i was saying that is uh, i don't know that is much better so the dove products i've seen them being talked about so much and at this point i really don't know who is telling the truth and who is not telling the truth so there's this one lady that um was on tiktok i came across her videos and she was like comparing uh the dove from du Bois and the dove from it was either kafo or naivas i'm not quite sure which supermarket it was and then she scanned this barcode let me show you you see that barcode that is at the back she com she scanned the two doves and both of the two products hakuna enyeli mpeleka kwa that dove site like so that does that mean that yenye inauzo kwa supermarket pia it's not like original like la, that left a lot of questions me personally i don't know how to tell if a product especially this skincare products i don't know how to tell if they are original or they are not i feel like from for makeup i've at least perfected it like i do know like specific vendors that sell original makeup and i'm very sure that the makeup they sell is original but for the um, 
for the skincare i really do not know so this lady scanned the two doves and none of them both the ones that she got from the supermarket and the one she got from the boys so i don't know i don't know i don't know what this means <laughs> i don't know what this means so yeah that's my review i've not had any problem with uh using the dove products i actually use this one and i also use this marshmallow and sometimes i use both of them sometimes i use one and i most specifically love this marshmallow milkshake shower gel it leaves my skin feeling so soft and it smells divine it smells so good so yeah another thing i wanted to talk about is how people feel the need to force other people into doing what them themselves they think is right i know that is confusing let me explain like for example i don't understand i feel like people in general don't know that human beings as a whole we have willpower to choose what we want to do and what we don't want to do the reason why i'm saying it, this is because when i posted this video a month ago of where to buy cheap body care products i had a few comments here and there and people were like they were saying how the boys products are fake even despite me saying on my video that people have been saying that they are fake at this point we really don't know allegedly let's use the word allegedly <laughs> People have been saying that the boys products are fake. I did say that in my video when I was when I was showing you guys where to buy. But despite me saying that there are still a few people who felt the need to come for me kwa comment section and tell me that them personally they don't think they would buy the boys products and which is fine. So who asked you? Really I don't need your opinion. <laughs> I really don't know what you prefer and what you don't prefer. If you come across a video on YouTube and it's like, oh, where to buy cheap body products, you watch it and you're like, I don't think I can actually get my products for, from this vendor. Just keep it going. Keep it moving and keep on searching for a video that will be giving you a place where you'll be more comfortable to buy the products. So the reason why I'm saying this is because I feel like there are those people who feel like they wouldn't use the boys products and it's fine babes it's fine if you if you feel like you you cannot use the boys products that is good for you but do not bash those people who are comfortable in using the boys products as for me me i'm a boys girl anywhere that we need to save the coins come me in put me on that list we are selling some coins that is just me so yeah in general don't just force people to like something that you also like just be okay and be okay with people choosing something different especially online i don't know why people feel the need to always force other people to choose what they like let me give you another example for example um let's say i come across a video of somebody who has gotten a second hand car right and they're actually very excited about it and they're happy and then personally i feel like i would never buy a second hand car one because you don't know the problem the underlying problem the car might might have so that's just my preference now in, instead of going to that video and bashing the content creator and telling them oh you know personally i wouldn't buy a second hand car I actually i would like to ship mine huh I want mine to to be brand new and that is you you have no right to go to that content creator and tell them i feel like i can't buy a second hand car but who asked you that's 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 her preference that's her so i don't know guys you just need to give other people freedom of choosing things that are different from you and you being okay with it like just be okay with people choosing something that is different from what you would prefer because we are different at the end of the day we've been brought up so differently we have different backgrounds and we have different environments and yeah i feel like people don't understand that so um, my point is if you feel like you are a babe who can be comfortable using the boys products then 100 percent go for them but disclaimer there are people who say that the products are fake so just have that in mind and also if you have sensitive skin just be a little bit careful when you're using the products 
so yeah that's just what i wanted to say i've been having uh, i've been wanting to talk about this for the longest longest time and i was like it's perfect because i've actually bought the products and i've used them so me personally um i don't believe those products that are bought from the supermarket are original that's just my opinion you can have a different opinion which is fine <laughs> which is okay and i prefer buying skincare products from the boys so yeah that's just it guys let me i feel like i've talked so so much let me plant my plants and then we choose an outfit then we get we we do what <laughs> we get started with the day so yeah guys so these are the two plants that i had uh, placed up on je. i've replanted them and then i've added some white stones and i feel like they look so much better looking like this so i want to place them out there and yeah we are done with the planting i think this was a lot of work i'm so tired <laughs> the next day breakfast and that was really really good i don't know why i never think of having breakfast <laughs> like <clears throat> every time when i wake up having breakfast is like the last thing on my mind but i'm glad that i had that now i'm going to skip lunch and then i'll just wait to have like a really good dinner how's everybody doing welcome back to another day of this vlog so i want to get ready and head out i want to go to mountain mall um initially i wanted to go to town because i want to fix my laptop okay not fix it per se but i need to buy a new charger imagine i've not uh worked on my laptop for like two months i'm even scared i don't know if it will it is still functioning you know two months is a really long time hopefully it will be okay but now i'm thinking town is very far i try as much as possible to avoid going to town i just don't like the hassle not the hassle i don't like i just don't like going to town <laughs> basically so um, i don't know any shops in westland so i guess i'll have to go to town but not today though i want to go maybe tomorrow yeah um that's basically it by the way i switched my plant i think you can actually see it i decided to place it so as i was saying i've switched up like a few things that i want to show you one is that plant that is at the background i'll flip the camera so that you can clearly see it but then i want to sell my mirror guys that black mirror yes and i love it but i feel like it's time to change so i want to post this vlog and just announce in case anybody out there is interested um just contact me on instagram if no one is interested then i'm going to take it to my fundi guy he can sell it and then he'll make like a new mirror because he's the same guy who sold it so it's his work so i'm going to go and talk to him because i've done this before there was a time i had a coffee table and i didn't like it i actually bought it on instagram so when it arrived i was so mad i think i had vlogged on my other channel it didn't look good it didn't fit my space so i went and talked to patrick patrick is the guy who made the mirror and he was like yeah cool just bring it we sell it and then i'll give you the money i even thought i even thought that when i took it to him he would request to like you know share the money because he because he's the one who has sold the table but he was like no just come i'll sell it for you and he gave me the full amount and i was like wow this is such a genuine person so i was so happy about it so i'm pretty sure if i take the mirror to him he'll also he'll also do the same as he did with the coffee table so i don't know why i'm out of breath <laughs> oh okay but then every time I hold this camera like this, I get so tired. Hey, I get so tired. So this is uh, what I was talking about. So this plant used to be Hapo Karibu Nacho, but I switched it up and I placed it here. And I feel like 
it looks so much better when it's here and then this tool was a side stool on my chair and i felt like it was hiding like no one could see it ah uh, so i decided to use it as a plant plant stand and yeah i absolutely love how that looks that space looks like now if we get a tv stand i'm planning of getting a white tv stand yeah i think it will look good with this space and then yeah that would look cute i know and then now this is the mirror that i was saying that i am selling so if anyone is interested just dm me on instagram we talk about the prices i got it for 4k but i'm not going to sell it at 4k 4k is still like a lot so maybe 35 35 is a good price because this mirror is really really good like the quality and it's very heavy like you can place it chini without worrying about it falling down because it's very heavy like at <laughs> i really had a hard time like carrying it hey it was heavy this mirror is heavy that's why i'm like maybe say i'll sell it for three thousand five hundred i think that's a good price so yeah let me get back so that you can see the size it looks pretty cute i love it but i feel like i need to switch up the style and i need to get a bigger mirror because you know me I'm, I'm tall every time i look at myself with that mirror i'm always my head does not fit so that's one of the main reasons and then i want to change the style of the mirror so yeah if you're interested dm me the same name stacy pimbogo that's my name on instagram we talk about the prices and yeah if no one is interested i'll just take it to patrick and use here because i know he'll do that so yeah i had forgotten this one thing there's a lady who usually watches me she's called mashariki she hooked me up with a really nice plant seller plant vendor uh yeah she gave me this page on instagram and when i checked them out i was so happy because that's the exact plants i've been looking for they're located in karen i'll place the page here in case anyone of you is interested in checking them out they have really really nice plants so i'm planning one of these days to visit them because karen is nimbali any <laughs> a whole safari that needs to be arranged so um i'm thinking i'll set some time aside i go there and i saw this one plant that was going for 1900 Th those tall plants that look like trees that's the exact plant i've been looking for and it was going for 1900 they also have other plants that are going for 450 i'll actually place the plants up across screen so that you can check them out eh, they have really really nice plants so i just wanted to shout um to give you the plug they are located in karen you can dm them and ask for like the specific directions and then i wanted to give a shout out to that babe who gave me the recommendation so yeah let's get ready then we go we step out <laughs> guys i know i said that i was going out but i decided to like clean the house a bit because it was dusty the thing is with this house um i don't know it's because of where the house is situated it usually gets dusty so much so if you don't clean maybe like even twice a week or thrice then you'll find your house being very dusty so i usually like try to clean it as uh, as much as possible the following day yesterday i went to the supermarket and i bought a few things i didn't want to show you that because i feel like you guys by now you've seen me shopping so many times and it's kind of boring so i decided i'll just do a haul i wanted to do the haul yesterday but i got home quite late and i was exhausted 
but uh, I want to do the whole now. So the first thing that I got are some flowers. Here they are. I want to switch up my flowers. I can't remember the last time I bought like new flowers and this looks so so cute. Can you see how they look? Yeah. And then I want to switch up from that clear jar to this. I want to place the flowers here, but I'll still place them up on Jukwa counter. So yeah, I think it's about time we use this vase. So yeah, that's the first thing that I got. Another thing I got is this passion juice. And I got it because it was on offer. Every time I, I go to the supermarket, I must buy like a different type of juice. I want to like taste all of them and then I settle on one one that I really, really love. So from all the other juices that I've bought, I feel like this is on top of the list. So the next time I go to the supermarket, I'll buy another one so that I can like try different tastes. So yeah, um, another thing I got is a um, liquid hand wash. Uh, the one that I have is almost over. Mm. Ooh, and this one smelled the best. This one was also on offer, by the way. So I got it. It smells so so good. Actually, didn't know that Hobim, uh, they sell hand wash as well. That's interesting. But yeah. That's the second thing. Another thing I got is a Vim uh, Lavender Fresh. That's the, um, the... Okay, yeah, Vim. <laughs> uh, this, was, this was so affordable. I wanted to buy... I wanted to buy... Um, what's the name of this thing? Uh, I wanted to buy Happy. But, guys, Happy... Zico so expensive. Imagine this was this was less than a hundred, I believe. Na happy ni maybe five hundred. Eish, no. <laughs> I said apana. So another thing I got is a uh, braid spray. I use so much braid spray. I think I also showed you like juicy too. I had bought a new braid spray, and now I have another one. You ingine Elisha. Imagine that's how much I use use braid spray and then i got some hair food Oops, sorry i got some hair food for my hair because i have braids on and i just want to have neat hair you know and then i'm trying to like make sure the hair stays for a while all right so the other thing i got is a nice and lovely cocoa butter and shea butter now, the reason why I bought this is because I saw Joanna Kinuthia raving about it and she was saying how like Nice and Lovely has a new scent, the cocoa butter one, and it's so like moisturizing. I do know that Nice and Lovely, they usually, their mafutas are not that thick when it comes to the consistency, like it's not the best. But because she said actually this one is a bit different, I wanted to buy and try it. So I bought the small one. If I like it, then I'll be buying like that one and then maybe I can buy a big one. And then another thing I got is a cologne. This is how it looks like. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I love this cologne. It's uh, from Chalimé. And a like a bottle inside. It looks so so beautiful. Mm, yeah, this is how it looks like. So pretty, so pretty, and it smells like mangoes. <laughs> I don't know. Mm, it smells like mangoes. While I, it looks so so beautiful. And then I was thinking maybe even when oh. It has a lot of alcohol. I was thinking when the when the spray like Ikisha, I can use this cup bottle to to do something else with it. It looks beautiful. Well, I hey, let me actually put it there so that oh, it looks so beautiful. 
and it smells so good the only problem is that it evaporates so so fast because i've tried i i think i wore it yesterday and i wore it yesterday no not yesterday yesterday did really fanya shopping um okay yeah i wore it yesterday at night i wanted to see how long it would last and it didn't last for a while so i was a bit disappointed and uh yeah i got it for 500 it was around that price and then another thing that i have is um what is this like a flower food i want to do that biashara now and then last but not least i got a toilet brush this is a sign for you to switch up the toilet brush that you have we're actually supposed to switch it up like very very often because of the germs so and this one was very affordable 120 as you can see and then i wanted a black one because i feel like it will fit the aesthetics in my toilet and yeah that's it now i want to arrange my flowers and then i edit this vlog i don't know if i'm going to be able to edit this vlog today and for this today but we'll see yeah let me let me arrange the flowers so that we can quickly edit the video and then i'll post it guys so i was trying to open this view and i was just see it's literally half you are like broad daylight robbery please why is this thing half i'm not supposed to be like that can you see i'm not even like i'm not lying why is this thing so kidogo like half of it you see now for me hey i don't know i've opened it and then I, I was like a bit surprised i'm like hold up what is going on hi hi anyway Guys, by this thing as you go And then I've tried looking for my makas and I can't find them. My scissors, so I'm just going to use I'll use my my knife. Because I don't have time to keep looking. So yeah. I would like to get to know if I could be the kind of girl that you could be down for. so beautiful oh wow that is so pretty that's my flowers oh my god they look so cute see i knew putting them here would be like a good idea oh my that is so so beautiful I have placed the plant and it looks good don't mind my kitchen I want to do some cleaning just now now that you don't have lights after I'm done like um, after I'm done editing I think I'll just tidy, tidy up the house but yo this looks so beautiful this is honestly so so cute and I love them so guys yeah we've come to the end of the video i want to just wrap up this vlog here so that we can quickly edit it and then you can watch it today hopefully thank you so much for watching subscribe if you haven't and uh, enjoy your sunday and i'll see you on my next video